Going on to current electricity, you need to be familiar with these 12 circuit symbols. So quickly going through them, we've got a cell which you must have to get a current. Adding two cells or more together makes a battery, a battery of cells. You need to connect them up with leads and you also then can get a bulb to light. Often you put a switch in the circuit so you can turn it on and off. Now this one here is a resistor, which is going to come on more. So the rectangle represents a resistor. The next three components are types of resistor. So this one is a variable resistor with the arrow through there. means you can change the resistance. This one, which is again the resistor symbol, but with a line through like that, is a thermistor. Therm meaning heat, so it's a resistor that depends on heat. And the last one is called an LDR resistor with arrows coming in to represent light. So it's a light-dependent resistor. More light on it changes the resistance. To measure electricity, the current, we use an ammeter, capital A in the middle, and we can also use the power or the voltage measured with a voltmeter. And a few of the components I'll come on to in a minute is a diode and also a fuse. Be familiar with those circuit symbols.